quickie before I go back. So as I finished eating my peanut butter jelly sandwich bite without having to talk with food in my mouth, what's going on? It's lunchtime. Lucky to be able to pick up my son, Jonathan Core. <clears throat> for lunch every day. And he's lucky that I can do it too. Just wanted to share this little moment with you out there, all your, our fellow haunters and Halloween enthusiasts and anybody that's watching. So the countdown to Halloween is in, is in full effect and it's very exciting. We still have more to do. No, it's, it's fine. We're not running out of time, John. Then Halloween's on the 31st. Yeah. Okay, we have three weeks. But anyway, the um. Come on. Yeah. Just spray. And the yellow jacks come back every time it's nice out. Let's pull it back a little bit so you can see. So we got Blackheart last year at the uh, the end of the year sale when everything is half price or whatever. And um, I think I told you this in another video that John really wanted Blackheart at the beginning of the season. But then he uh, saw other ones last year we're talking about, 2023, that he preferred, like uh, Hellspawn and Emmeline. Well, those are the two like must-gets last year. And when we saw them, he was he was like, you know, a kid in a candy store. Just, yes, gotta get him, gotta get him. And of course I did. But, um, yeah, so anyway, this is Hellspawn. I mean, this is uh, Blackheart. And, I mean, it's cool animatronic. I don't know I don't know why John liked it so much. I mean, I guess, you know, because it looks like Jack from Spirit Halloween. Yeah. Well, it looks like Jack a lot. But me, my opinion, the only thing I don't like about this guy, which I mean, I like every single animatronic out there. They're all cool to me. It's very hard to choose one. And I have to really think about which one I like the best to tell you which one my, is my favorite of all. Um, I'm probably gonna say Hauntress because Hauntress was the first one that it was like, I guess a real animatronic, if you wanna call it that. I know Jumping Spiders are called animatronics or jump scares. But uh, the Hauntress was the first one that uh, that I actually bought to start this whole entire Monster Core thing. Are you crooked here? I don't even know if you're crooked. I'm crooked. I never have a V8 today. Sun's blaring in, in our eyes, so it's hard to gauge. But um, Hauntress, I would say, would be my 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 first one. You know, the, the most the specialist one, honestly. After that, it, it was just so many. And then it's hard to even say which one which one is is our favorite or the best, but um, we don't really have a have a favorite, honestly. We, we like all of them, and they all have their place, and they all have meaning. When you're into something like this, it becomes a hobby, you know. It doesn't become an obsession, you know. It doesn't become hoarding or or crazy. It becomes, you know, fun. Yeah, I think that when they, I think this was the display model, so they took it apart the way they did. So you have to figure it out. It'll be all right. But anyway, enjoy hanging out with Jonathan. Let me finish making his lunch. He's having little bagel pizzas today and some rotisserie, rotisserie grilled chicken. And uh, then he has to go back to school. So hang out and enjoy. And uh, we will definitely keep posting, do more videos this week, a lot more videos. I have to do a couple of returns myself to uh, get more um, monies and uh, get rid of clutter. You know, clutter is stuff that you don't use. 
clutter is not having hundreds of animatronics and pinball machines and arcade games and monster trucks and RCs and stuff. That's called fun, but we just don't have a, a lot of room. We have, we, we have maxed out on room. So anyway, I'll leave you to be and I'll stop talking. Maybe John can talk to you a little bit and tell him, tell you guys what you want, some good stuff. And we'll see you in a few. See, yeah, I'm rocking my this weird Halloween shirt. Did he really just do this to you? He really did.
Smell what I smell. The pizza's almost ready. Look, we have a receipt. That doesn't help because it's from last year. They should honor last year's receipts, not for nothing. They really should. When you spend thousands of dollars at Spirit Halloween, you should get honored and, and be able to exchange an animatronic. Especially if it's broken. You know? Just saying. <clears throat> Especially when you make videos about Spirit Halloween and advertise their stuff for nothing. I mean, you know, just my opinion. But maybe we need to have 10,000 subscribers before that matters. So make sure you subscribe to our channel and let's get to that 10,000 mark so that they actually take us take us seriously. We only have 4,300 right now. That's, not, not, that's nothing. It's on the work in front of the camera. Can you work in front of the camera now? Yeah. Alright, we'll do some We'll do some heads on camera camera angle here. Jonathan doing some intricate stuff. Yeah, they shouldn't have done that. I don't know why they did that. Now I have to go through all this. Alright, don't worry, still got time. Remember when the when the Zion bells go off, that's when we have to get ready to go back to school. We have a, a, a natural alarm every day from the Zion Church.
explain to them what happened. Bro. I don't know what happened. I, I don't know what happened at all. See, explain to the, explain to the, whoever's watching. What do you think happened? I don't know. I don't know. I never heard this case. Explain to them what happened. Cheers. It's always fun to build animatronics when you drink coffee. But Jonathan can't. Not yet. Yeah. What do you need me to squeeze it or something? I don't know. I need you to do something. I can't figure it out yet. If I can't do it, I don't know if it's. I don't know. I'll see. I might. I'll need your help. Okay. Let's put this. Awesome iPhone that I got that doesn't work the way it's supposed to work. Down. 